please subscribe to the channel and hit the bell so you will be notified whenever I upload a video. Please also thumbs up or down the video to let me know which direction to go for future videos. Thanks. The reason black women are so angry at Kevin Samuel's content is because we know that he's lying to black women and he's doing it for likes and views. He's trying to enrich himself, no matter how destructive his message is for the community. Today, Kevin Samuels tries to paint a picture that most black men have their lives in order, they're responsible adults, they're the prize that black women should fight for because they're wonderful, they have so many options, and other races of women are fighting for them because they're so desirable. But when his message was directed at men, it was totally different than it is now, where he described them as being stuck in a high school mindset, as being lazy, as being not good enough for black women. And yes, I do have the receipts. Don't worry. But when he got that sudden burst of fame with his average at best video, that's when he really changed his platform, which now focuses on women and what women need to do in order to get a so-called high value man. And with that, he's also very rude, insulting, and degrading to black women. And the more subscribers, the more animated he became with his sound effects and circus performance. This is Kevin Samuel's channel. He deleted most of the videos from his first three years when he focused mainly on men. First he made the videos private, then he deleted them altogether. All those two and three hour videos are gone, and what's left now are the short fashion and cologne videos. He went through a lot of trouble to delete those videos because if he uploaded a video a day for at least 300 days of the year for three years, that's at least 900 videos, and they've all been deleted. But isn't that what scammers and criminals do? Try to hide the evidence and scrub the crime scene? Kevin Samuels doesn't want those old videos out there because what he has been telling men doesn't align with what he is now telling women about dating, especially since the black manosphere has been echoing his talking points. This next video is an example of the content he doesn't want to be seen. And it's about a woman's age. The talking point now is that a woman's value decreases with age and she hits the wall at age 30. He now has men believing and actually repeating this nonsense. But listen to how he goes on and on and on and on about a 40 year old woman and the value she brings to a relationship and compare that to what he's telling women today. A 40 year old woman, I would take her over a, a, a smoking 25 year old any day. You give me a 40 year old woman that that's in the gym and shape feminine, uh, man, shit, where is this chick? I need to show y'all some fine ass 40 year old women and understand something. Boy, boy, there's something to be said about a woman who's who feminine, got her stuff together, and not still out here in that young stuff. Let's be real, dude. If you're 40 years old plus, you're not trying to go to the club every weekend. You want to sit back in the house, smoke a cigar, have on your velvet smoking jacket, your cool shoes, a nice scotch or a cognac or brandy, doing what you do. Man, you you want some high class shit. Every even if that's not on the shit you're on, even if you even if you just on some Netflix and chill stuff, you want a woman who is going, she's going to compliment your life. To Kevin Samuel supporters and followers, you need to hear this more than anybody, because you are the ones blindly taking his advice without question. To the women who ask Kevin Samuels for dating advice. He's publicly humiliating you for his own fame and fortune and parading you in front of the lowest tiered men in society. And to those concerned about whether or not Kevin Samuels was able to delete the relevant content that will show his lies and inconsistencies, his efforts were in vain because he was too late. <laughs>